Amidst the fury of a stormy night, a storyteller's restless slumber is disrupted by an electrifying idea that ignites his imagination. With lightning as his witness, he pens his creation, infusing the page with the intensity of tempest. Excited to share his vision, he texts his friend. Hey. You free for a shoot? And he waits. And waits. And waits, but he doesn't lose hope. But a crushing refusal leaves him disheartened. But even in face of rejection and solitude, he'll continue. Never mind, he quit. The problem of shooting a cinematic sequence of yourself is you need somebody to shoot it for you. And let's be honest, nobody will be there for you 24 7. Welcome to the channel where we delve into the magical world of cinematic storytelling. I'm Ankit Bhadwaj and today we have a topic that will help you elevate your self filming game and create stunning visuals. So let's dive in. The easiest shot you can achieve by yourself is by using a tripod. When going solo, you should invest in a good tripod. A stable camera is essential for achieving a smooth and professional looking shot. However, tripod is not the only solution. You can totally be creative and use any surface allowing you to capture sturdy footage while you are in front of the lens. Now that you have a steady base, let's talk about framing. Whether you're shooting inside or outside, framing plays a crucial role in creating a captivating video. When filming yourself, pay attention to the composition of the shot. Use the rule of thirds to position yourself off-center, creating a visually pleasing and balanced image. Experiment with different angles and perspective to add depth and interest to your shots. Just one frame can make your video look stagnant and monotonous after a certain time. To keep your audience engaged, you should keep switching your locations. Take your viewers on a visual journey by filming at different places. By switching locations in your edit, you add visual variety and create a more dynamic storytelling experience. Now let's take it up a notch and add visual storyline to your videos. Even if you're talking about a particular subject, incorporating visual narrative can enhance your viewers' engagement. Think about the emotions you want to evoke or the message you want to convey. Plan out visual sequences that complement your storyline. This could be capturing the process of creating something, your daily routine or maybe a mini travel log. By weaving together your words and stunning visuals, you'll create an immersive visual experience. In addition to these points, there are a few more techniques you can employ to tell a story in a beautiful visual manner. One technique is using creative camera movement. Camera movement can help guide your viewers' attention and create an engaging visual experience. Now I know most of us don't have access to remote sliders and robot arms. The thing you can do is to shoot in a high resolution and add movement in the post. Another technique is the use of atmospheric elements. Incorporating elements such as smoke, rain or fog can add a sense of drama and cinematic ambience to your footage. These elements create a visually stunning backdrop that enhances the mood and storytelling. Lastly, pay attention to the color grading. Color plays a very crucial role in setting up the mood and tone of your video. Experiment with different color grading techniques to achieve the desired cinematic look. You can either use a LUT file or color grade manually to get a consistent color palette that enhances the overall quality of your video. By the way, watch this video if you want to learn how to color grade like a pro. If you found these tips helpful at all, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. We are here to support you on your cinematic journeys, so stay tuned for more such contents. If you have any questions or suggestions, leave them in the comments below. See you in the next video. Till then, happy filming.